Elizabeth, this is all beginning this morning. Thirsty athletes have been working all year round, probably years leading up to this, to make it to the well. And it's all starting with dual team tournament this morning. Weigh-ins are at 8, and then they're going to start hitting the mats right at 9 o'clock. And then they're going to be competing all day long. Championships and finals tonight at 6.30. And this is all leading up to individuals that begin tomorrow. Now, this is a big deal for the local economy. They're saying about 80,000 people typically come out to this uh, wrestling tournament. It's four days long. Fans, family, friends, they descend onto the Metro and are here to cheer on their little athletes. Now, we did find there is one female that will be competing today. She's here with her team. She'll be weighing in this morning. That's some exciting stuff. But we hear it's a great pool of athletes this year. And then when we spoke with Greg Edwards, the president and CEO of the Greater Des Moines Convention and Visitors Bureau, he said this is just the beginning of a very exciting sports season here in Des Moines this year. And these people have a lot of spare time, too, when they're in town. When their teams aren't competing or their athletes aren't competing, what are they going to do? They're going to be hanging at the malls. They're going to be shopping. They're going to be bowling. They're going to our movie theaters, um, spending lots and lots of dollars throughout the metro. Now, if you want to come on down for some of the action, it's $10. You can either get your ticket online at Iowa Event Center. You can come on down and buy it at the door. Uh, they also are letting folks know there's plenty of parking. You can park down here at uh, the Wells Fargo Arena parking lot, City of Des Moines parking garages, and then, of course, meter parking downtown. But pay attention to some of those listings uh, and what can be done in those parking areas. A lot of exciting things, a lot of action to be seen here coming up in the next half hour. We're going to get into a little bit more details on what you can expect in the, in the days to come. For now, back to you.